Welcome to the latest news making headlines in the current affairs and in the entertainment industry in Uganda right now. Hey, good morning. This is the Buzz UG and just in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications because you don't really want to miss on any updates happening on the Buzz UG. Now, before we go to the main stories, I have bad news in Fifi Da Queen's camp. Uh, she says yesterday, uh, thugs stole all her belongings, uh, you know, the documents, the phones, everything. And uh, she cautioned the public that in case you're called and told to send money, please don't give out any money. Guys, let me hope I am not so fine. Bans, documents, my own documents, my own documents, I'm a simu. Do not give money out. Do not give money out. Sina kabenge do banzi vye mitu neba bituala neba ambiti bababa. Well, there you go. That is the bad news coming in from Fifi Da Queen's camp. Otherwise, right here on the Buzz UG, uh, we are very sorry about that, Fifi, and uh, we wish you a very quick recovery out of that experience. <music> Now, in other news, uh, it's very sad in Honorable Robert Chagulanyi, aka Bobby Wine's camp, that is National Unity Platform. They have lost another comrade, and that is none other than Ejoku Elias. Now, according to NUP Secretary General, that is David Luis Rubongoya, he says Elias was one of the most reliable NUP mobilizers in Teso sub region, and he had been hosting most of the mobilization meetings in Soroti City. Now, Ejuku was murdered by unknown people and his body was dropped at Mulago Hospital. But according to the information on ground, it seems Ejuku's death was political because the killers only took off with his laptop and the phone and then left all the money that he had in his pocket. At the time I recorded this story, uh, the president of NUP, His Excellency Robert Chagulanyi Sentamu, aka Bobby Wine, had not commented on Ejuku's death, but NUP's Secretary General, that is David Luis Rubongoya, says it's a difficult time for them as NUP party. Uh, may his soul rest in peace. Now, in other news, uh, it's about a week ever since Dr. Kiza Besije was put under house arrest in his home after he attempted to protest against the skyrocketing prices of commodities. Now, yesterday, Dr. Kiza Besije's lawyers, led by Lord Mayor Arias Lukwago, visited him in his home. However, police did not allow journalists to access his home. Actually, they allowed only five of his lawyers. Now, later, after meeting Dr. Kiza Besije, uh, his lawyers told us the condition they found him in and what next. To say Dr. Besije, inga talibu vi na yatenga simu sanyu futee ya gara kubanga msa jalima kage na iba mbaga funde komera. Aganti abaye chagukulao msao from time to time. Aganti yengo msa ja ingiri yokuteka akamere ku um, okumeza wajimulemese za so oramu wukalubie. Wano bafudeo police barracks. Erecho chimuruma, chimuisi zabu vio kubanti ya makake baka fude police barracks. Ngaba menya court order. Eranga agamane chitabu chibata deo echaba visitors. Chiveo amangu dalanga wichisoboka. Uruwe nsonga, mtanaba wakulu kusakuteka wano. Chitabu echo ntiba wandika ba visitors wababa genji. Government jiaba police bo, Dr. Besi Jomukirize, abene mirembeji. If you want to detain anybody, then you must do so within the law. Produce that person in court and say why his freedom must be taken away, which they are not doing. So all the police is doing is acts of impunity, breaking the law, violating. And this is why every Ugandan must be worried. Because you see, acts of impunity like this, it's not just directed at me. It will be directed at you or any other person. That's why... You know, human rights are universal. They, are, they don't have boundaries. So every right-thinking person must condemn what the police is doing. There are about eight or ten tracks 
used in blocking access to my place. There are hundreds of policemen here. Who should be used? Whom we pay? Whom taxpayers raise a lot of money to pay to maintain law and order, to deal with the criminals? I am, you know, approaching 70 years. I have never been involved in any form of law breaking. So for the police to be engaged here all these days and police resources and so on, when real criminals are going spot free, is a matter all Ugandans must protest. So I have no intention whatsoever of ever sitting on my rights. I will protest. These policemen will go away sooner or later and I will, con I will follow them as they leave protesting all the way across the country. Now, Uganda police, through their spokesperson, that is Afande Fredenanga, says they will do their best to make sure that such actions of protesting do not prevail in this country. Now, the president of NUP, His Excellency Robert Chagulanyi Sentamu, a.k.a. Bobby Wine, in his message to Dr. Kiza Besije, he said, While our camps may have differences in how we approach the question of what strategies and methods we should use to dislodge the Museveni dictatorship, please know that we do hold you in very high esteem. Well, there you go. That is one of the paragraphs in Bobby Wine's message to Dr. Kiza Besije, who is under house arrest for almost a week right now. Now, in other news, uh, two days ago, media was filled with information indicating that UPDF is set to retire senior military officers, including former security minister, that is General Eli Tumine, General David Sejusa, General Andrew Aguti, General Prosi Naloiso, among others. Now, the latest news about this story is that the spokesperson of UPDF, Afande Felix Kulaije, has dismissed that information that has been circulating in the media. Now, Afande Felix Kulaije says people should stop circulating unconfirmed information. <laughs> Omukoro gwa mwezi gwa musanvu kino kimwade mutambuza tuchafumba omuganda agamba nti nsubulanga gwo sune bika byagala nchaba sumulira munga mutandika kusomola yo nsaba mugumikirize nga bufuno lugambo ngolo manya ncho yo anonya bibiye kasuke irigasia mwe bale nyo kumpuliriza well there you go that is the spokesperson of UPDF Afande Felix Kulaije now, in other news, and this is coming from the entertainment industry, uh, the election of Uma president is getting geared up and we all remember last week, Bebe Kool attacked King Saha and revealed that King Saha has always been NRM. Singa Saha ba sinze njabali ndechi watuli. Era press conference nze ndijikola. King Saha uwe NRM. King Saha, si watubonga na hawe. Yaba gambe konta wakile NRM. Now, yesterday, during a press conference, uh, King Saha bitterly responded to Bebe Kool and also called upon all the artists across the country to vote for him because leadership is a calling and he says he's been a leader in different aspects of his entire life. First and foremost, leadership is a calling no one can escape. And I believe I was born a leader. Zimbabwe mukule mbe zimbula mu wange bonna bwe bade kola chi ntambulira mu nenga ntambulira mu line twagala buli muntu abuganyure eida nga ali wala obanga ali kumpi twagala buli muntu aberenga ali iko mukule mbe zimbula nga abufuna mu chenkanyi ngo mwana ali e masaka feeling represented mukule mbe zimbula nga muhimbi twagala obukule mbe zimbula obumanya obwetavu mbakubira omulanga bayimbi banange mu naje muri guno gwe mukisa go tuina okuzimba industry ya fe Balimeba kubira masimo baka anga kanga Nti ate woronda saha Government teja kuyamba Kwa gala idea uma efune respect Bayimi banange Music wafe akutoge de banga dene Gunogwe mukisa gotu ina Tumuruani lile Tumanye royalties za feziri Wabini mtuka pio gela freestyle Kumanga biangu bite dereke kama angu Zin, Ono matiri yo wafe Ututula ni tukurieti nga content Mukuru wafe kasta uri ya chagula nyamanya walu wakalimu Oh, Kastawuri le ringe ya manyawalu wakachi, akalimu. Gwetebeleza, 
abantu banja ba endosi nga banja lwachi atunulira omuntu omu kati chechinga tane kenzo kubana yansa yimingira chechinga tane aruna chechinga tane shiba chechinga tane spice chechinga tane kamilioni chechinga tane moses matovu wa frigo chechinga tane jiwanita kawalia chechinga tane abayimbi wona bansa yimingira tujje mbozi njagala nyumu manyaba yimbi wona bali vaito kati ye azude relevance weri yogera kusaha enjuri akatugo Joka era bidobula dobo bumunumi de banga yeyongera bwese embereza tusigaze banga tuno kutereza bituli ebyo nna uno bukulembeze bwa bituli bingi tukenda busy batusigaze kituli chimunga teke tuziba zakayo ayagala nyo bulimu obwangu katikanu yakala banga kachi akali mu bingi byaba kweka teso abagamba nakezi mu office ni mampa ye milioni 10 nwani so no na sabani ya time akubira abayimbi chinomu Kemulonda saha, government te jamba yamba. Ela nanga mchifani naba dengi za koku na retinga obu oza wawa. Sika tali, jakunda mupati tu, banyo nyuri. Well, there you go. That is King Saha, the incoming president of Wuma, if trusted by fellow musicians across the country. Well, I told you the elections are happening on the 23rd this month and definitely I'll keep you posted with all the details right here on The Buzz UG. Otherwise, thank you so much for subscribing to The Buzz UG and just in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Remember, I told you, you got The Buzz, you got everything. Thank you.